G'day everyone, uh, 2022 is here and Perkins Engineering YouTube channel's back. This wasn't going to be the first episode, I must admit, but we're up at Bathurst at the National Motor Racing Museum. We've actually brought some cars up, dropped one off in Sydney yesterday, and we've got a John Goss XA hardtop in the back, which is going into the museum. And then we're picking up a couple of our cars to take back to the workshop in Victoria. I actually have a special guest on this trip, none other than my old man, Larry Perkins. He's been riding shotgun in the truck. So I thought I'd uh, kick off this year's YouTube series. Say welcome back. Um, I'm looking forward to bringing you the first proper episode, which is gonna be in the workshop where we continue our comparison of the cars. Um, but this one's gonna be quite cool as well.
right, so the first time driving the Volksy in how many years? Oh, uh, the, uh, what, uh, 85 Wind Safari, I got it to the finish line at home, so that's a long time, 85 to today, and uh, the cracker lap at Bathurst, I haven't done a lap at Bathurst since 2003, my last Bathurst lap in my 2003 race car, and to do another lap, I was going for the record, but uh, I don't think it got anywhere near it. Did you ever think you'd drive this rocket around Mount Panorama? No, I never never ever thought I'd get the opportunity, but it felt good, I tell you, this feels good. It's, it's, I mean, it doesn't feel as good as a new car, but <laughs> it, it was good fun. So now back to the workshop, what do we need to do before this rocket's going to be racing in the Paris Dakar next year? <laughs> Well, a lot of things. The first thing, I better get it registered, uh, but that's another story. And uh, uh, a couple of small jobs, uh, uh, the, light, the lights aren't, blinkers aren't working properly and a couple of things like that. But mechanically, it's 100%. So it's ready for a Dakar other than those small things. And I've got to put some new uh, Bridgestone tyres on it because these tyres were my new tyres. I bought in 78 for the Repco and they're still the same tyres. And they feel a bit like hard in the compound.